Okay, so yes, if you didn't know by now, I if you're seeing this clip, you'll know that I did not film the other part of the um haul thing that I was gonna do because when my other Act One albums arrived, it was late at night when I eventually got them because I was at work and they arrived when I was at work, but I was too excited to not, so I opened them straight away. Um, <laughs> which is why I don't like, I can never do these like collective hauls because I always want to just open them straight away. And usually whenever they arrive, I can't film because my family are in. So yes, but I did end up being lucky with my second badge. I pulled the two remaining evidences that I needed. Well, I still needed to get one, but anyway, I pulled two different ones and I pulled the other quote card that I needed. So his full card collection is complete for Act 1, which is amazing. Um, and, and I only pulled three duplicates. <laughs> like, alright. So, yes. So, the other white card will probably go to my friend um, when we finally get around to doing something. But anyway. So, yes. So exciting. So, we'll just start off with Taman's binder. Um, try not to knock anything because it is quite far up my... Helpful. We'll move these from the way. Also, I apologize for the lighting because where the de my desk is is not in front of a window or anything. So yes, um, actually, this thing. So I am collecting his more rarer card. Where's my pen that I use? So yes, I am collecting his. Misconceptions of Me version B card, which is his more rare card. Um, and I found it for a very good price on Macari, so that's why I'm doing it. So it's on its way. And then technically his full card collection will be complete. Because before it wasn't complete until I would have bought this. But yes, so that is on its way. But I did move everything down, which it's weird to see. However, it means like the story of light is all together. Um, want is essentially all together. Just two here, but these are what we need. So, not only am I going to be putting away taming stuff, but I do have a big box. Well, not really. It's not really big. Um, full of stuff. So, yes. Full of stuff that I also got in my uh, Macari thing. So, I have the... Two slides from Taman's album, which we'll be putting away. And I have Beckyon's as well. Um, and then the photo cards. So these are all the Taman cards that I have. Then we have Beckyon, which I'll pop over here. And then we have two Silgi and a Mingyu as well, which will go into a different binder. So for Taman, so I'm only keeping obviously the ones that I don't need, I uh, do need Sorry, the duplicates I will probably either sell or trade. So yeah, so these three, well, this will probably go to my friend. Um, so yeah, these two will probably be up for sale or trade to anybody else. Um, but yes, so I'll just need to get some sleeves. Yes, I really hope this is all in shot because otherwise I will be just filming this and talking to myself for no apparent reason. I don't want this one. I've got like two different sets of like sleeves in here because I'm an idiot and put them all together. So yes. So now how do I want to arrange this? So obviously the... So black bags and then red bags. But what's the backs of these ones? Because... Okay, so these are the red ones. Oh god. There we go. So I think I'm gonna put the black bags first. Um, I think doing it like that. Yeah, that'll do. 
Okay, so this. And I know SM will pop a Kino out eventually because that is just the way that they do it. Um, but yes, and I will be collecting everything for him, even his Kino cards. Because let's be honest, I I'm a sucker for teaming. So yes. Because usually SM doesn't give him as many cards as they did with Beckett, no doubt. Because for City Lights he had six, for the light he had... Oh god, he had six normal version cards, then he had the two for chemistry, so that's eight. Then he had the three Kinos, so he had quite a lot of cards. <laughs> um, he had 11 cards, I think. Yes. My mass is correct, I'm sure it was. So yeah, he had 11 and he is apparently coming back eventually sometime later in the year, so I will need to prepare for that. But yes, we're not talking about Beckham right now, we're talking about Taman. So we'll take that out. See, I really like doing these videos. But, and I like watching them as well. This is probably my favorite one out of them all. Of all the cards, if it's Oscar the Grouch, Oscar the Grouch. Um, oh, oh. so yes, that is the card then. Because I stopped doing like the what's the word, the more spread out thing because I wanted to keep him his cards more. Um, condensed but yeah. so yeah, I do have quite a number of his Japanese stuff on the way I'm actually nearly complete it I don't know how I've managed that but yes okay well let's skip to the back actually no it's here so yes so these things so I did end up pulling one of his tickets as well however I thought they would be white on the back turns out not but will they fit in these? It'll be helpful. Okay, they do fit. Hmm. Okay. But I need to get these things. So these are the two things that I pulled in my album. And these are the things that I'm going to put here. I will need to put some white papers behind it, but of course I will do that later. And then we of course have the films. So I think this is the suspect one. I'm gonna assume so because it's red. <laughs> postcards because there's only two of them but there's four of these standees which I am going to be collecting at some stage so I'll just pop one ticket there because I do have the other one on the way I did buy it from Makari for very cheap so yes these so these standees I'm just going to put up here for now until I can be bothered I'm going to get a four pocket so yeah they will just stay there for now um <laughs> The ticket will go there, even though it's non chronological order. But I just don't want these things by themselves, so yes, I think that's it for Taman. Yeah, it is. So we can close this up. And then we can move on to probably we'll do Becca next, but yes, so for Becca. I, oh, I'm taking these off. I've got keychains hanging here. I'll fix that later. So yeah, for Beckham, I have this. So I have one of his Hey Mama ones, which I think I did show. I did film this, yes. What am I talking about? So I have another one to add for his Hey Mama set. I still can't find the third one. So I might take a bit. 
Um, but this page will be complete. It's other Blooming Days ones. The final one that I've needed for basically two years now. So, yeah. There we go. Oh, it's so exciting. And I love the backs of his. So, yes. Also, this is the delight page. I could go back and get the other two Kino cards, but... I probably will at some stage, let's be honest. If I can find them. I don't want to get the other um, City Lights one because I can't find it anywhere. Oh, went past it. So here we go, Obsession. Finally will be complete. Well, apart from his other Kino. So I made the rule that I'm not going to be collecting his Obsession Kino unless, of course, I find it for a ridiculously good price. Which, let's be honest, is never going to happen because that is just... I don't know how why that one is so expensive. I really don't. And of course, I have Super M um, that I need to collect both him and Beck, um, him and Taman for. Oh, so the other collections will probably take a back burner for a bit, especially since um, was it since um, if he's coming back, then of course there's going to be other. Member is going to be coming back because I need I want to start collecting their soul stuff because I collected for shiny so I would want so yeah because I collect the shine other shiny member soul stuff I would love to do it for EXO as well but not much but <laughs> so for Mingyu teenage is here I did also condense this as well into just being more full page because I do like seeing a full page of cards so this is be his the first one on this page I like how it's in the center as well <laughs> so yeah this is it's more the recent albums that I've had more luck with like kangaroo's done oh this is my little John Han cards that I don't want to get rid of so and I did move them into this more smaller binder because yeah, they don't tend to have as much stuff. So for Silgi, I have this red summer card, which will go here. Oh god. I was lucky to pull quite a lot of Silgi when I first started collecting red velvet albums. So yes, and then this is her day one, which is here. And I think I have a couple more cards for her coming. I think I have one of her Perfect Velvets. And I have... No, this is her Summer Magic one. That's the wrong one. Uh, day one's the other one. So yeah, I do have her Summer Magic and I have one of her per Perfect Velvet cards on the way. This one. So this page will be... It's complete. Is this, is this the right one? Aye. Because I'm only collecting two cards for the day one. For the. Oh, for God's sake. For. The festival. There we go. Because I finished day two, day three. This is Monster, then day one. So the only albums I have nothing for are RBB. It's RBB, yeah, because I have. And the red, technically. Because I pulled the group so I'm keeping the group <laughs> but yeah she's nearly done which is quite good just need a couple more things because I'm not collecting everything from her so yeah because I only have two from monster and two unit cards so yes that is it for this video so yes but yeah so I'm going to be updating all the binders so I've got some cover pages that I want to put in because I want to put cover pages back in um and plus I am collecting a new group so yes I have one card to put away for them but I will be going to mark off things that I do have on the way so yes um and I would organize for twice's comeback as well as 17's comeback but I don't know the actual details with that so yes closer to the time maybe I will do that but right now we'll just update with the stuff that I do have so, 
Yes, we'll start with the cover pages that I want to do first. So, yes, so I have my twice binder here. So this is the start of it. And I will find... So, yeah, so this is basically the page that I have. Very minimalistic, but I quite like it. So yes, um, this is the way I'm going to show off the photo here of OT9 of course, who I'm collecting and what, so I'm just collecting Sana as well as some OT9 sets. And it looks like roughly from the guide that I could, there could be some OT9 sets that I could collect from twice, so yes. But since I'm in the binder, I do have some Sana stuff that I need to mark off because I've been slowing down with my progress with Sana. So I don't know if I ever updated this, but I did com end up completing lane one, which no lane two. This is lane two, which I'm so excited, which I'm so happy for. So I have finished the majority of the older sets apart from Signal. Still needing this one card, but that will be another thing. Twice the gram has been done for a while, and then I completed Merry and Happy as well. So yes, um. I need to find my Naokyo stuff. A few moments later. Okay, so I don't have any. I think the cards I do have are from Fancy onwards. I think so. I think I did find the last two Fancy cards that I needed. Yep. Yes, I did. So yeah, I've got my Naokyo. Um, thing here that I'll just be keeping off to the side with my pen that I had. So yeah, so I did end up finding the last two cards that I need for her solo cards anyway. Let me take this out. So I'll just mark them as coming. Because I wanted to complete at least her solo cards for both Fancy and Feel Special before Man. before I tackle Eyes Wide Open because I don't think I'm going to be doing a group using a group order for it so I was like I will be needing to trade because I don't pull Santa very often so yes but I have them on the way and then for um so yeah I have the gold card on the way and I do have her Polaroid, or dark Polaroid, on the way, so she will be complete. There is one more card essentially for this era, but basically it looks dark as, and I do not like it, so I will not be collecting it. So yes, then I'll just need to focus on the OT9 sets, which I'm trying not to complete as fast, because I'm finishing them quicker than I am her actual sets, so yes. The more and more is completed, which is quite nice. Um, one thing that I do need to mark off is that I do have her, yeah, I've already marked off. So I do have her lenticular on the way as well from Fancy. So yes, that should be it for twice. I don't have much left to collect, which is quite nice because I'm not collecting, of course, Otin, um Japanese stuff or anything. So yes, um, we will go on to um, actually, we'll go into my extra binder first because I don't have anything to put in there. Oh. Considering this is my fullest binder, because EXO have a lot of stuff. Like, let me just close that. Like, just it's so thick and heavy. They have way more cards and they have way more um, releases outside of the actual group. So yes, and I have this one. I wanted an OT9 picture, but of course, Don't Mess Up the Temple was the last OT9 <laughs> comeback we had. Comeback. <laughs> um, so, yes. I did. I still need a couple of things for Beckyon. But he is basically done. Um, I did try to reorganize this section. So to have an order. 
And I did put his obsession booklets in here, which is probably why it's so thick and heavy now. So, yes. And I also put his, the folded posters that I do have for Delight in here. So yeah, the honey one is my favourite, of course, because it's actually the one that you actually see most of his face. So, yes. And I think, then this is more random stuff. I put some OT, I put some of the filler group stuff in. So I put some Nature Republic cards in that I do have. Their season's greetings. Ah, that was it, Super M. So for Super M, he has one card from the album and I'm already dreading it if I don't get it because I applied for a group order for it. Um, he was my second option, Tabin was number one and man that card is going for a lot of money on Makari. So if I don't get that card, um, I will cry So, because it's an adorable card um, but also um, why are people pricing it that much. <laughs> Even Taman's is going for a lot and his is not cute whatsoever. No offence Taman. Because it's far away and it's not a selfie card. That is why. So by Sanskrit you get one group card and one um, member card as well as the IDs. I forgot about the IDs when I was making this. So I'm only collecting two IDs I think. The Both of the group versions. So there's three IDs in total for each member. Because there's two versions for a full group album, which are the two versions that I did pull, that I am buying. So, yes. Or maybe I'll just collect one ID. I don't know. Because I don't want to collect everything for this album, because I have just made it so unnecessarily much with stuff. So, yes. As long as I collect his album cards, I should be fine. And he only has one, so. Yes. But I did put his poster in here from the first album and then I put his and Jungin's um, concert stuff together so yeah and I think that's it because the rest of it is the rest of solos and subunits so I think that's it for Beckian so we'll go on to this binder so this is my red velvet 17 and my newest collection, my newest collection, um, which is The Boys. I'm going to be collecting three members of The Boys, but not as fairly because I made my own rules with this. So, yes, but we'll start at the back because I do have stuff to insert in here. Yoink. Oh, God. So I already made, so this was for their newest album. And then here is for reveal. I did end up pulling one of the members that I am collecting's card, which is Hyunjae. So I pulled his moon version, oh bugger, which is great. So I'm going to be collecting the moon version as well as the transparent for moon. For three members, so Hyunjae, Nu, and Eric. So, oh no, all my sleeves just fell out. Okay, but yes, yeah, so this is going to be a challenge for me, probably, because I this is the first time I'm collecting a group who's not my alts, but three first time collecting more than my bias for a non alt group. And yes, so it's going to be interesting, but I don't. Come on, good. Ah. There we go. But yes, so, but I do have, I think, cards on the way for them. Okay, so I have Eric's is on the way. And I think News is on the way as well, or it's in the McNeokio warehouse. So, yep. Yep, so. And I have news on in the Macari warehouse. Macari warehouse in the Naoko warehouse. So I have their full cards done. I've not tried to touch the transparent cards yet, but yes. And then for Dreamlike, I'm collecting both the Dreamlike and DIY version. I probably might change my mind and just stick with the Dreamlike version, but 
I don't think I have anything for them for that yet. Nope, I don't. So we'll skip that. But for Bloom Bloom, I have all the cards on the way. I think because I'm collecting both versions because there's only two sets and I think Bloom Bloom's in a gorgeous era. So I have them all on the way as well as the postcards. I think the only one I don't have postcards for is Eric, I think, but that's fine. So, Eric's cards. And you have pink hair during this era, which is gorgeous. Did you like he has purple hair? Which, like, hell yes. And of course, both of this. This is adorable. I love his cards in this era. Yes. Okay. Get that back into frame. But one thing I need to do is, of course, put. Oh, this is exciting. And then we've got 17 here. I've not made much effort with this at all since Hingare finished. Since I finished Hingare. But by the sounds of it, he will, he's only going to have four things to collect, I think. I think I'm going to collect the photo card based items. Uh, and maybe one pre order, depending on what they do. So, yeah. Why is that? Oh, I was going to get a truth card. That was it. So, yeah. And that is not on the way. I could, I miss thing with it. Do I have a Mingyu card? No, I don't. It's all shiny and red velvet. So, yes, we'll just skip Mingyu. Um, put that there. I need to get, I fought, sort of fallen off the bandwagon with uh, trading and stuff. Oh, I did put um, the stickers from, oh God, I did, from Monster in here. So yes, and I did end up completing this page. I don't know if I updated with that, but yes, but I do have two things to put away and they're both on this page, which is amazing. So I have, these two cards so this is her summer magic limited card with the cutest back on the planet because i ended up pulling this in my normal version and i have one of her bad boy cards here probably my favorite one so yes finally making some effort with <laughs> this page I just like how this little four corner is the one that's complete. And there, three of them are horizontal cards. Thanks, Silky. But yes, open that. And then we got red velvet. Huh. Done. Now we'll go on to the big boy. That is, oh God, the shiny binder. Oh God, even this is heavy. So yes. Um, this is the one thing that I'm waiting on for, from my Japonica haul, because that is the one, that is going to be my holy grail card, essentially. But yes, we're going to skip to the back, though, because... <laughs> to the solos. Oh, I did the same thing here with Super Rem. For Taman. Here we go. To keep him. So yeah, I did end up completing his face collection. His face photo cards finally. Actually. Let's switch these. There we go. So yes, finally have that done. Um I do have his other two heart card on the way with the actual album. I have to, they actually have the album coming, so I just need his other I Wanna Be card. 
and I can just say I cannot find it. So this is gonna be fun because I'm not collecting any other kinos for them. So yes, and plus the other ones are that cute. So yeah, owner's been done for a while. So yes, and of course he is back. I was actually watching his live. Um, before I ended up filming this, I was waiting for him to finish so I can start filming. No, the man went on for two hours. <laughs> um, so, yes. Then we have Jinyan here, who is complete. Um, then we need to go to the Japanese page because it's all Japanese stuff. I think. I'm actually thinking of getting the Ace kit thing <laughs> for Shiny. I really am. Oh, these are new things. So I did get, this is kind of a spoiler to the, uh, one of the cards I do have. I do. I did end up buying Dazzling Girl from Shiny, the big pink one, to get the full card. And it came with this raw photo of Taven. So I just popped it here next to the Boys Meet You uh, postcard things. But it also came with these things that I just popped together. So I put... This the collage of Taman with the group and then this one of Taman by itself. I fucking love this photo. So yes. Is that it? They're still going. Oh, actually. I do end up getting the other ticket from a uh, criminal. I'm never gonna dance act one. This one you can hardly see anything in it. So cheers SM, but but that is done. Never gonna dance again is officially complete. So yes, and he is kind of hinting that he's working on act two. So I'm expecting that to be anytime soon. But yes, okay, so We'll start here. So I did get his oh god, his Kimi no Saide card, which is absolutely gorgeous. It came a bit bent. All of them are a bit bent, which is kind of sad. So yeah, I ended up buying this in a free, in a free what's the word set thing. Actually, I'm gonna. Hmm. Alright, we'll flip it this way so it'll be the same way as five. Uh, wait, a Wonderland I have as well. This is it. I hate how <laughs> these are blooming um, horizontal. But yes, then none for this page. I have two for here, 1000 years, which is this one. This one came a bit. Crooked as well. So, yes. And finally, Dazzling Girl. Oh, wrong way. And there we go. So the team in Japanese snuff is going along pretty well, I would say. I'm honestly shocked that it is. <laughs> but yeah, so I plan to just try and buy his cars with the actual album, unless I see like the more rarer ones for a good price. So yes, the ones I'm finding trouble finding are the first and I think Sing Your Song and Lucky Star. They're the ones that I'm finding the most difficult <laughs> of finding but anyway we'll get there eventually but it's Korean stuff is all complete once that finally arrives in and we have the title page Ooh, nice so yes that is basically it that's all I have today. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in another one. Bye!